Welcome to Breath of the Wild. But we're gonna have a quick cutscene first. <laughs> the large Pokemon you see wandering around the wild area are strong. If you try battling one, it seems like you're in over your head. Try to run. How strong are we talking? Oh, gee. Okay, yeah, run. We couldn't get away. Th oh, thank God it despawns. And so does that berry bush. I can't invite others. It's it's just going to be me. Oh, you straight up get some AI partners. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> you know, that's not so mes menacing when it's just a Togepi. Togepi use max rockfall. Oh, God. <laughs> it's dead. All hail Wulu, destroyer of worlds, renderer of galaxies, the fluff that leads us to salvation. <laughs> we can make a religion out of this. Oh god, I hate it already. I forgot this Pokemon exists. I'm sure we're not going to be absolutely sick of this animation. Um, when it plays for the 50th time. Are people going to be very upset if I don't use Wulu for literally everything? Because I, I could do it, but I feel like it's going to take like 10 times longer to play the game. I'll use all the experience candy on Wooloo. How's that? 20. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh my God, that gave even more. Oh, he's angry. Oh no. Muffin looks like it wants to play a lot. Let's chat. <laughs> yeah, that's a normal reaction to a sheep approaching you. Muffin seems afraid of LSD. It's okay, Muffin. You just, you just, just steer clear. <laughs> You don't have to ingest it. Yeah, I think this is an instant add to the team. Katana, you're off the team. <laughs> Been replaced by a strangler. Wait, did we already evolve? Jesus Christ. Your muffin evolved in the dub wool. Jeez, this seems like a massive place. Yeah, I'm here for the gym challenge. Okay, to the stadium. That onyx just blipped into view. Yeah, it's gone. Like... <laughs> I don't understand the draw distance whatsoever. Like, Jesus, it looks like a barren wasteland there. And then, Onyx. Okay, so are we getting the Parker or do we like our current top? No, no, don't do it. Okay, all right, we're done shopping. We don't have a lot of money. <laughs> where, where do I go to get a haircut as well? Okay, the eyes are now soulless. But outside of that, doesn't look too bad. Oh, high-tech earbuds. Range of earbuds allow you to freely control the volume of various sounds. Oh, so to unlock audio options, you need earbuds to actually get those earbuds. Yeah, I didn't have these before. Yeah, like, you unlocked options menu. Like, imagine if you have to play, like, a, like an hour of a game. Just to unlock the chance to, like, you know, set the texture quality. <laughs> One look at me tells you you've become a trainer worthy of that endorsement I gave you. Yes, I reckon you might even be ready to use this. Here, try giving this to your partner to hold. It's a piece of charcoal. <laughs> Removed from the context of the Pokemon world, that's just a really weird interaction. Oh, I didn't do the league card thing, did I? Make a new league card. This one looks like they're in pain. Print it. Yeah, so we can now use headbutts. So this is going to be significantly stronger. Wait. Pfft. Ironically, the attack animation is a kick. Another cutscene coming up because there's hot. Who the fuck are you? Are you kidding me? Hop, I literally don't care about your entire life right now. I don't care that you are ever freaking born. Can we undo your life? Excuse me. Who the hell are you? You took the time to talk to a Pokeball, so you deserve a little reward. You obtained a Pokeball. Guess you're one. I'm not just any old Pokeball. But then who am I, you ask? Well, the answer is simple. They call me the Ball Guy. Marry me with your strong, muscular arms. He, he's proper fit, this man. I just want to explore a little bit. The city looks so cool. Corvin has a Pokemon that flies all about, carrying people where they want to go. Even they get tuckered out. I want to explore the world. Oh, that guy is far more detailed than everyone else in the gym. He is going to be a central character. <laughs> Please enter your uniform number. I would do 666, we have no soul anyway. Yeah, all trainers take a bar book to the room at the nearby bud you drop in. That's the league chairman for- I thought you said champion. That's a bad sign. I have PTSD already. Okay, so we gotta- we gotta wait a day. The plot demands we take it slow. You're looking a bit gobsmacked by all this. You're also a main character now. The fact that you have a name just means you're important. 
Because there's so many people here I've talked to that simply don't have anything. Okay, let's go to the inn, which is going to be... <laughs> Uh, you can't even let me walk over. Let, let me move like 10 paces without being pfft, shoehorned into the specific place I need to go. You could have just said it was nearby and that's where everyone's checked in and Hop could have said, sure thing, I'll see you at the inn. Like, welcome. I am here to escort you to the inn. Welcome. We've arrived at the inn. Oh, we have to find a Minchino. Likes to play in the water and also likes the sound of whistling. The most important thing for young ones like you is to live the way you want. That's, that's sound advice, man. Live the way you want unless it goes against the game's railroad. And that's kind of ironic, isn't it? The great black storm covered the Gala region. People call it the darkest day. That man was assaulted by a gigantic Pokemon. They were defeated by a single young hero bearing his sword and shield. The statue here is meant to depict the young hero of that legend. You don't understand what kind of sword and shield the hero actually had. The sword and shield were Pokemon, because he was a Pokemon trainer. He came all the way out to this big sea so he could properly cheer on gym challengers. Team Yell is here to help, after all. You're in for a battle if you want to stop us. You know they're evil because... Oh, because they have a Vuvuzela. Yeah, that's that's the possibly the most evil thing you could have. Oh, they got the Zigzagoon. It's the new form. It's gonna... Oh, it's times four week to fight. It's dead. This is level nine. <laughs> Wait a minute. This Pokemon's attack animation when we used Headbutt was a kick. But then we use Double Kick, and it just jumped on the sweat. Th Why fucking bother? <laughs> it's such a little detail, but like, the kick animation is there. <laughs> okay, well, these are all going to die. <laughs> Who are you? I'm you, but stronger. Yeah, I think we're a bit overleveled. Double sheep attack. Get on our level up. Sorry about them. They're just a bunch of my fans. Call themselves Team Yell and follow me around, cheering for me. I think they've let it all go to their heads a bit. Oh, she's got a toxic fan base. <laughs> just so caught up wanting to support me and all that, they tend to get a bit shirty with other gym challengers. That is a very PG sensor. I believe the correct term Marnie was looking for, they tend to get a bit shitty with other gym challengers. <laughs> well, there's a bit to explore in the hotel, at least. I hope we can go into all these rooms. Yeah, we could just look at this man staring at a cardboard cutout of the city. So this is it. Now my legend really begins. Oh, I'm so sick of him saying his legend begins. Why is it both him and Leon just say the same things over and over again? Jim Challenger, the open inside. Can you not even let me walk to the stadium? No. Fuck off. <laughs> yeah, I don't have any problem walking to the stadium. Stop asking! Uh, give me some agency, please. I can't get over that. And here's the Minchino. <laughs> if this happened in real life, you'd be fucking terrified. Oh, he's giving us a bottle of water too. Okay, thanks old man who lives in the fountain. There he goes. The man went home. Yeah, here it is. The missing Mancino went back to the boy. We gotta go back to the boy ourselves later now. But now it's given us agency on something where I actually wouldn't mind if it teleported me back to the boy. Because now it's just like a fetch quest. I gotta go back and find him. This is the one time where it's like, if it held my hand a little bit here, it would actually be convenient and save a little bit of time. Found him. A bottle of throat spray. This is just getting weird now. I don't like the direction any of this has gone. Okay, we're all geared up. 666. It's the totally not evil ruler of everything. He's gotta be the bad guy. Oh, the gym leaders are showing themselves. They're just gonna be here. Uh, what's wrong with the guy in the back? Yeah, Alistair, he's, he's not looking too good. I think he's been drugged. Wait, is that it? Oh, please don't tell me that's it. I want to fight the gym leader. Gala region's ready. I gotta go, because it's a busy bee at evil. See ya. Gym Challenge is an event which aspiring trainers travel around the gallery to try and collect gym badges from eight of its gyms. They're in a gym- I- Yeah, I know how the gym challenge works. You just- you just explained it like four times. A gift. Such a wonderful thing. From the chairman. Such a wonderful man. 
No, he's not evil, guys. No, he's just a sound guy. No one's obsessed with him. He's not doing anything wrong. When traveling to a new place, it's best to get there on your own two legs, don't you think? Yeah, I think so, but this fucking game keeps taking me everywhere. <laughs> That's sound advice, and I would very much like to follow it. But you keep railroading me everywhere. The fucking irony. I'm gonna stop playing the game if I encounter Hop along this path. I'm actually just going to stop for the night. Just the nerve of this game. Like, we think it'd be great if- 